sometimes it's because of the media, you know, but a lot of people, you know, grow up and a lot of people, you know, be having a thought that they want to be rich. But you also have to ask yourself, do you know what it takes to be rich? Do you know, do you even know what it takes to live a rich lifestyle? Do you even know what you would do with the money? Because there's a lot of people, and you can look at a lot of stories. There's a lot of people who got rich overnight, won the lottery, or got rich however, and they didn't know what to do with it, and things were worse, and they end up messing up their lives more than if they had never got the money in the first place. So even if you got a larger sum of money than you've got before, say you got that now, would you even know what to do with it really and how to spend it? Are you in control of your habits? Because having more money means you have more options to do things. So are you really in control of yourself? Are you in control of your habits? Because some people, they get that money and now they're able to spend more on their habits to the point where it's way more than they're used to. Would that overcome you? Can you be honest with yourself on that? Or do you really know? How would people around you act? Would they act the same? Would they act different? Do you really know? Being rich comes with more than just money. And I don't know all the aspects of it. But there are definitely aspects that we aren't seeing and aren't looking at. But besides that, do you know, if you're leaning on the idea of being that, do you even know if that would make you happy or if that would fulfill you? Do you know how to be fulfilled? What if you get that granted to you and you find out it's not enough? Then what? Again, would you know how to maintain yourself and maintain your mental health through that? Do you know what kind of lifestyle you can even afford? Another question, have you ever even calculated to see if it really takes that much money to get what you want and need? Because it may not take as much as you think it does. You may think you need more money than you need. It's a lot of, you know, songs, you know, music, and, you know, people saying things like, you know, don't date a broke guy, don't date a broke this, don't be broke. But nobody is really explaining what broke is. Nobody's explaining that. They're just kind of leaving it very vague and Some women are determined and broke to be something that it isn't, or they're confused about it. And it's making some of y'all lose out because y'all are thinking some of these dudes are broke and they aren't. If you can't manage what you have now well, what makes you think you can manage twice of what you have now well? That's just a question. Now, maybe you can manage it well, but it's on you to really evaluate yourself to see if you are managing it. And I think a, another misconception is you don't need every new gadget to live well. You don't need the newest car to live well. Now, if you can get that and you want that, that's on you, but you don't need it. 